How's it going guys? My name is Alex. Good evening. And welcome to another video where I'll be talking about the tactics and this time I'm talking about the possession football. If you are picking a manager with possession football and if you are playing possession football, you're probably getting used to this type of possession football and this is what Konami wants you to play. Diarrhea one touch passing when you want to get rid of the ball as fast as possible because you know if you are about to Make an additional touch, Konami is going to be punishing you because uh, what they have come up with uh, this season is the tackling from behind. They are not being punished by the referee, they are of course all fair and square and for some reason even a slight nudge on your Erling Holland or uh, Rodri or any other player with good physicality is enough to get the ball from him. This is very frustrating but unfortunately there is nothing we can do about that and this is of course prompting us to play this vantage passing and this is what I noticed a lot of people are playing and I, as much as I hate this I'm trying to uh, have my take on this I'm trying to still deviate from that and play a different type of possession football. Uh, at the same time uh, understanding what Konami wants from us and uh, without further ado we need to get into the division game because ultimately my goal is uh, to get into division one and hoping that we have a good uh, good display of possession football you know that i'm enjoying playing with this five at the back formation the most attacking formation in the game arguably because your winbacks are involved and you have uh, seven players in attack and uh, of course our goal is to get into a uh, division one and eventually i'm hoping we'll be doing that but on our way we're facing different opponents and this is probably the game where i want to show maybe something like this oh what a start what a start are we scoring a kick of glitch goal yes we do okay, well, also. No! Uh, okay, so not the really goal that I'm very proud of, but uh, possession football at its best, uh, my opponent wasn't really pressuring me, and uh, this is what I like uh, when opponent is not really applying that pressure, which I also hate uh, how it works this season. Uh, it's also allowing you to uh, think before you're passing, without like doing this, this is what you're doing. We are doing one touch passing, my opponent making a mistake, uh, Karl Heinz Miguel with double touch, uh, turning the ball around, maybe turning the ball into the side and taking a standing shot, and what a sliding tackle there! And Joe Cancelo is there, but he can cross, maybe he is crossing the ball, uh, Kylian Mbappe is scoring another goal, come on. Goal! I mean, come on, this is way too easy. I'm not sure if I'll be uploading this game. It's, is it way too easy or we can still show what we can do with this possession setup? I'm playing with Luis Enrique as a manager. I'm playing with five at the back and at the same time I'm having uh, the most attacking setup in my team. Uh, this depends on how you're playing, of course. You can back pass, but you can play where attacking and uh, Kylian Mbappe passing to Kalkin Zumiga, Kalkin Zumiga passing in the path of Kylian Mbappe, Kylian Mbappe turning uh, into uh, João Cancelo, João Cancelo, and now he's passing it. Okay, so this is what I wanted to continue, but sometimes it's not really working as I expected. And of course, the main aspect of uh, really uh, good possession football, as I'm trying to uh, spread the uh, pitch a little bit wider, but Zinchenko was uh, a little bit delayed, his run was delayed there. Uh, the main aspect of possession football is high press, so uh, if you want to have a lot of possession, you need to press very high and ensure, okay, my opponent is like, almost intercepted that ball. You need to ensure that uh, you are uh, pressing very high and this manager allows you to do that and uh, this formation allows you to do that. Bruno Fernandes maybe cutting inside and maybe taking a curl. By passing to Kylian Mbappe, Kylian Mbappe taking a shot, what a goal it could be, and that's hitting the bar there. So we are enjoying, uh, uh, actually we are, uh, we, are, <laughs> we are scoring the goals on the break, I would say, but still at the same time we are enjoying some possession, and uh, uh, the main idea of possession football is uh, to see the open spaces and put the ball there, and uh, it's not only just one touch passing, it's also through passes. So sometimes it takes more than one touch. But before, because of the input delay in the game, uh, you need to, of course, think in ahead a few seconds ahead because it is terrible in this game and we all agree on that. Uh, but it's not a big deal. Like, you get used to everything in this game. Uh, Zinchin, passing Van Dijk. You see, and Golo Kante wasn't really open there, but because I made these two passes between Zinchin and Van Dijk, the space opened because my opponent decided to drag his players. So this is very important. The spaces will open, just need to wait and see. And pa Pirlo, not really passing there, but maybe you can... Use okay, he's not Mike there. This might be playing much, uh, much up there. Let's see if we can stop Lucas Paqueta from advancing. And uh, yes, great, great. Pirlo, what we can see there, yes, our fullback 
joining the attack. Zinchenko passing to Pirlo. And this is how we have so many options up front, but we are passing to Zinchenko again because he's an offensive fullback. He's continuing to run. Maybe we can cross now. Stunning cross from Zinchenko. What a chance for Nkaha. Okay, so this possessed, but this is... This is, you love to see it, you love to see it, your fullbacks involved, finally, this is why you have them, not because you're ex expecting them to win headers in defense, just because you expect them to actually join the attacks, and uh, we are, um, we're scoring two goals, uh, we had some chances, we had 60% possession in the first half, I hate it, it's really effective, I hate playing it like that, because it's not like real football is playing, uh, there is no, not a single... Uh, football game uh, maybe there was like an exception but it's not usually the case so one touch passing is good but it's not realistic uh, like uh, it is uh, forced uh, to play by Konami you know what I'm talking about okay better check is switching to Joe Cancelo I mean come on this is bad this is actually bad this is why I like my fullbacks to be real wide and this is why I'm actually using them in in this uh, way but at the same time uh, in five at the back but at the same time Sometimes these passes are not going through. Okay, Pirlo intercepting. Here in Benzema, we're enjoying uh, the fullback run of Joe Cancelo's double touch. Oh, look at that player. He was completely mad at Joe Cancelo. Maybe that can be a solo run by Joe Cancelo. Joe Cancelo, Joe Cancelo. Okay, come wait. Double touch and being dispossessed, unfortunately. Now, this is not a possession football at all. We need to be sticking to our guns here. Um, Rolling Holland, passing to Kim De Bruyne, Kim De Bruyne to Joao Cancelo, Joao Cancelo there. He can perform a standing cross there. Yes, he does. And what a goalkeeper, he's parrying the ball. And now uh, that's another very good pressure from Andrea Pirlo there. And now we're exposed. We can go back. No, we can bar is there. Joe Cancelo again. Finding the pockets of spaces. Kevin De Bruyne passing it. One touch passing. Kevin De Bruyne maybe taking a stunning shot from Kevin De Bruyne. I wanted a di different angle there, but uh, I'll take the corner. One more time. We're not playing this one touch passing just for the sake of playing one touch passing. We see a better opportunity. We see an opportunity to take a shot. We're taking that. Why not? And uh, if we see there's an additional touch needed to be taken, we are taking that because we are not succumbing to what Konami wants us to play this season. This is a bad corner, by the way, but we're still picking up the ball. Kevin De Bruyne passing to N'Golo Kante. N'Golo Kante with a stunning shot and that's overpowered. Stunning shot, unfortunately. We'll try to, of course, cut off these passes if possible. Uh, Erlen Colland is there. I mean, I need to... This is where your pressure, uh, manual pressure matchup... Uh, is uh, important. Okay, Karim Benzema, and he's been rewarded there very quickly. Karim Benzema passing it to Kevin De Bruyne. De Bruyne, we can make a quick goal here. Kevin, Karim Benzema, what a save again from a goalkeeper. But we are pressuring very hard and we are trying to get the ball back again. And now it can be again back in bar with the cross. He has a good crossing abilities. Now, uh, okay, <laughs> we are just spamming crosses this, at this point. It's not possession football at all, but let's see. Zinchenko, okay, one day. Beckenbauer spreading the pitch as wide as possible. Look at my fullback. It is a defender. Is it the defender really? No, it's an attacker. It is a midfielder at this point. So this is why I like this five at the back formation so much. Uh, let's see. Uh, Zinchenko. Yes, it is. He is in defensive midfielder position. Benzema dispossesses there, but a little bit. This is why input delay is important. You need to take that in consideration. Every single pass input delay should be taken in consideration. Beckenbauer. Kante. Pirlo. Kante. Just don't be discouraged to take additional touch because sometimes it's important, but sometimes one touch passing is also important and now can be a vital attack. Kevin De Bruyne about taking a shot. Again, a goalkeeper, what a save, but Kevin De Bruyne there. He's stunning shot. He's the, Oh, that's a stunning pass that didn't find anyone there. I can't believe we only scored two goals so far. 82nd minute. Maybe we can press a little bit. Uh, our opponent is making... Oh, no, 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 Eric Holland. Uh, now it is a curler there. Yes, it is a goal. Que golazo. No! I mean, I will be not uh, saying that this was a result of um, <laughs> one touch passing or possession football, but that was a result of pressing. This is also, if you're playing possession football, that means that you're pressing also very actively. It's not like you're uh, staying at the back and waiting for the ball to like deflect to you eventually. I mean, this is what I like to play, uh, gegen pressing. Regardless if you're playing counter-attacking, although counter-attacking is suited to Gegen pressing a little bit better. Now it's Erling Haaland passing to uh, Pirlo, Pirlo to Benzema. Maybe it's a chance for Benzema finally score a goal. Yes, he's scoring near post to P and we're scoring four goal in the game, which we deserve to score much more. Que golazo. No! Magisterio! 
you love to see it scoring four goals in a game where I wanted to show possession football. We didn't really show it to the best of our abilities, but at the same time, uh, we showed that possession football is not only a vantage passing. Even though Konami wants you to play all the vantage passing uh, sequences because it is so hard to maintain possession of the ball. People, uh, by the way, 10 shots, 6 on target, uh, 4 goals. I feel like this is a decent start for a game in online divisions. And uh, we move. We move, of course. Uh, this was a nice uh, few sequences of passes. The, the first goal, by the way, was the best example of possession football because we were waiting for the runs. Uh, possession football not only uh, one-touch passing, it's also waiting for the runs inside the box. Sometimes that split second that you're uh, waiting waiting, 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 and a uh, player making a run, and you're performing a through ball. And that is also important uh, way uh, you can score a goal with a possession-based manager. Hope this video helped you. If you want to make more videos uh, on different tactics, uh, drop a like on this one, and I'll see you next time.